and in ridiculously weird news that you don't really think exists, but apparently it's happened anyway. Snoop Dogg <laughs> has decided to make everybody aware that he is a big fan of Coronation Street, which I don't know what reality we're living in, but that was not what I was expecting. How, what do you think about the D.O. double jizzle? Jizzle? Fat jizzle? <laughs> yeah, so, uh, I'll report... I don't know where he was talking about this, but Snoop Dogg said, Coronation Street, I love it. If they call me, I'll do it. I'll play whenever they need. Which is... <laughs> it's great, I love it. It's such a weird story. Like, why? Like, Snoop Dogg. Snoop Dogg probably murdered a man. Well, allegedly. Wait, what? Uh, that, you, know, know, you know, he, back in the day, he was a. He was a bit more. He was a bit more in the uh, gang life stuff. No. Oh. Uh, which is very, well, you know, back in 1990, he was convicted of possession of drugs and possession. Uh, he was arrested in connection with the death of a member of a rival gang. You know, he's not exactly the most squeaky clean, but somehow. Some it would be big for the nation to um, Snoop Dogg has actually, like, maintained this really positive image. Well, that's just because he's been really wholesome for like the last 20 years. Oh, yeah. Have you ever seen the Just Eat ad with him on it? Or... Yes. Yes, I have. It's I somebody just... say, oh, Steve. I don't know how he's managed to... He just makes so much money. It's ridiculous. He says, yeah, I love he's... the cinematography, acting, the storylines, and just the reality. I'd like to be a part of it because they've been part of my culture. <laughs> That's absurd. Please tell me he brings his big WWF championship with him. Sorry, his WWE championship. He would never do that. Damn it. I'd love... <laughs> Can we get Hasbulla on as well? Bring Hasbulla. <laughs> but yeah, um... <laughs> I don't really know how much there is to add. What, what else does Snoop Dogg do? Snoop Dogg's everywhere. No, I would love to see him on the cobbles. Let's let's state our intentions. If Snoop Dogg does show up on the cobbles, we will have to do a review of the episode. Maybe even some form of live stream, perhaps. Um, but yeah, Snoop Dogg heading to the cobbles. <laughs> What would even, I suppose the most interesting other example of an act of like a famous person on the cobble. Old Sir Ian McKellen. You know, he was on the cobbles, you know, bloody Gandalf, <laughs> Magneto oh, from X-Men. You know, he, he was on the cobbles for a for like a brief period where he was this like he was this like scam artist essentially and he just tricked a lot of people into giving him money um where is his who did he play on Coronation Street uh did it did it that's on stage TV Coronation Street he played Mel Hutchwright slash Lionel Hipkiss. Uh, he essentially conned people out of money. And he was a dodgy novelist. And yeah, he he did 10 episodes back in 2006. Or 2005, sorry. And yeah, it's a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. It was a good storyline. And yeah. That's the, that's the biggest other example of like a famous person. I suppose Cheryl Cole also appeared on the cobbles at some point. King Charles, obviously before he was a king, and apparently Will I Am filmed the film filmed a music video on the set. 
which is confusing. Uh, apparently Tom Jones was also there. I don't even know. I don't even know. <laughs> but yeah, Snoop Dogg come into Coronation Street. Hopefully soon. I look forward to it. Do you look forward to it? What do you reckon Snoop Dogg would do on the cobbles? And would it be stupidly good? I think it would be funny. <laughs>